Hello and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Geheimnisnacht, the Warhammer mod with, of course, Lord Wreck of Cadran Swell. We are once more back in the northern mountains of Krakadrak, and, well, we're gonna make a move and hold her here. She's a little bit possessed, but that has never stopped me before. Oh, it's good to be the Lord, indeed. Um, we are here, of course, a Lord. We have plenty of troops. Plenty of troops. 2,000 of them at the moment. That's, that's a good amount. Um, wait, what? What? Why can't I declare war against this guy? Oh no, okay, I see. I can declare war against my liege lord. I'm going to sell this guy for 10 gold. I could uh, declare war against this fool. And we do outnumber him somewhat, but I don't know if we would be able to beat him and then siege down the territory. I would rather fight this guy who definitely doesn't have as many troops and we definitely would beat him, so... Um, it's clear to you that King Volun's commander is nothing more than a rebel, all brawn and no finesse. You, on the other hand, are an experienced tactician and a great teacher to debut. Perhaps you should offer to train Volun's commanders in the hopes of gaining his favor. I shall send him a letter offering my services. Sure. Don't know what to do with it. To my loyal subject, the sincere Lord Rack, your offer is the most generous. I graciously accept your offer and will remember this good deed in the future. Excellent. Now I will have leverage on Don't know what for. Okay, so, make someone vote like vote like you on the council of law issues, prevent a force uh, prevent a force of realm peace from your leash, ask your leash to press one of your claims in the war, state Start a low vote for your leash. Force acceptance of an arranged marriage proposal. Force acceptance of a kid child. And plot a stop looking. Invite court proposal. Call to arms. Oh, really? Force acceptance to call of arms. That's nice. Ask to embargo proposal. Join factions you lead. Or to give you a council position. Wow! Didn't know I could do that much, but I do not want a council position. I have one, but yeah. Uh, we are at war with this fool right now, the the ropesman, and he is sieging down some territory down there, which is not good because he might siege down my territory, and we do not want that here. Did we, we build, ah, the clan barracks are not yet done, okay, that explains it, because this is going to give me so, so, so many more troops once this is done. Yeah, I upgraded that last episode. How terrible. During a mission to try and fabricate a claim to a title in Kurum Kuldanor, my cancellor has been murdered. Ah. How unfortunate for him. Well, we're just gonna send the next one. It's not as good, sadly, so. Uh, sure, I'll come to your feast, my friend. You can count on me to arrive. For a good drink and better food. We're just waiting for this, uh, this tiny little bit of a clan barracks to be upgraded. And we have a long reign now happening to us. We are still a beardling though, which is bad. We need to not be that. I don't know how old one needs to be. I actually can look that up probably, like beardling, and then just look at the oldest one. The oldest one is pretty old. Though I don't know if these can actually... Can females be not... This guy is still very old, so... I suppose it's like a hundred years or something. Oh wow, they are suffering heavy attrition over here. And also they need to siege this forever. Let's get it started. Yes, a nice little bit of carousing. Um, we do have this guy. Yeah, this is play and I lost the game sadly. I am a game master though so who knows. Yeah, it was very fun my friend. It was very much a fun endeavor. My nephew is the yeah my nephew is also the king. I see. Oh, my broken spirit man what happened with you? What happened with you my friend? I can't form alliance, even though we are friends. Um, what do I need for a non-aggression pact? I guess I can't form one because we are, of course, friends. 
Use artifact, that uh oh one of Major's Tomb of Warp Dust. Okay, I thought maybe that's how you use uh how you use um the potions that you can gather. Okay, so we have uh how much gold does it cost for me to raise all my forces? It costs me Oh, thank you for the gold, that's very helpful. Um, that's not. It's not costing me a gold. It's costing me more, I believe. Yeah, but I still can't afford it. So I'm going to disband them, and I'm still gonna wait for the clan barracks. So right now we have about 750, and we're going to get much, much, um, many more troops. Wow. Okay, a thousand. So 250 more troops. That's really nice. Sadly, so we did lose basically all of the levy that was in the castle. So they need to be replenished first. So that's gonna take some time. Oh, the garrison's also not full. Hmm, that's bad. From Tiber Cherries? Huh. Interesting. Uh, sure, I'll, I'll come. Yeah. I will go to your feast, my friend. I mean, I could probably beat this guy anyways, but I do want these additional troops. And I need them. I should probably send over my marshal to speed that up. So, sadly, we're going to do some troops over here, I believe. Uh, I don't know, maybe. Maybe not. I do have a daughter. Maybe not, but this is, should speed up the levy of reinforcements quite a lot. Like, yeah, pff, quite a lot. Oh, we did lose, like, 600 men, oh shit. And we do gain them here, so... I don't know. Uh, I become... Who? I introduced... Uh, I don't know, my heir is now rival to someone, but I don't know to whom. This is not going fast enough. What kind of special units do we get here? Gunners? Oh yeah, gunners. The heart of every dwarf realm. Let's play. I'll get you next time still. Come on, give me those troops. Give them to me a little bit quicker. And that's my doorbell right there. But I'm not gonna answer right now. Obviously. So I'm gonna wait until he has like a thousand troops and then I'm gonna send you back over to my capital. I do want most of the troops from my capital, even though that also means that you know, Consular Lofenheir gives a lot of troops. Oh yeah, that's really good. The reinforcement rate upgraded, uh, up, up as well. That's gonna speed it up quite a lot. I might actually send you back over to the capital right away going to lose like 600 available troops but that's not a problem because it already has 700 men here or 800 men and we're going to get more troops over here now again yeah with 2000 men I think we are ready to attack this guy in a claim war we're just going to march at him and we do have some commanders yes Yes, maybe I should fight myself here. Yes, definitely should take on the lower amount of troops here, the smaller amount. And we will crush them. I don't know why we only have one front, but it doesn't matter. We're going to destroy them. And now we're just going to siege him down. I am no longer temperate, sadly. Um, do we have someone who could siege this? No, not really. This guy is a dwar dwarven warrior, so that's nice. But that doesn't really help me in this case. So now it's just just a long time of waiting. Actually, I should probably be like resign and resign. Because then no bad events can happen. And we don't really get a benefit from the commander here anyways. So, lean back and wait now. This is gonna take a while. Oh no! 
My daughter has died. Someone murdered her. Who murdered my daughter? Very rude. Uh, yes, a burger tax of legation rule. I have proof of that. Why would I not? Where did I put the. Never mind. <laughs> I have like a bag for. for bottles. For plastic bottles that you can recycle. But I don't know where to put it. I, <laughs> I must have forgotten it downstairs. Yeah, uh, so, as always, I'm sorry for the lack of episodes lately. Oh man, is it, is it really that laggy? It looks... I hope not. I mean, it is a little bit laggy, but on BS it looks a lot worse. I hope that is not the case. I guess OBS tries to record in a lot more FPS than what is actually displayed. Um, sure, let's get a goldsmith here and see what he offers me. Uh, 300 gold, 150. Uh, well, surely a good Christmas is the most important I expect. I can't really afford anything better. A simple set is going to be good enough, I think. Isn't the best set any kind of worthless anyways? Because it gives me like a magic item or something, like a staff of, mag of mage <laughs> magic that I can't even use because obviously I'm not a mage. So most of your vassals are going to be mine. Oh, you do have a lot of troops from the mans, though. More than you should, for some reason. You're also a very, very bad marshal. Also a game master. It's probably this guy who invites everyone. Okay, I could ask my friend, my friend, my friend, to join the war, but I'm not gonna. Not in this one. In this one, I would probably ask him, but right here in this one, I don't need him. Because we're slowly winning and we have so many troops that we can call once uh, the war is over so we will have many many more troops to take on this guy and we're definitely going to beat him actually he does have a lot of troops so i probably should wait oh me me son has a son we should wait until this has its levy replenished so that's going to be really nice it is also prospering um isn't my capital also prospering it is probably need a a little bit of a hospital over here, but that's very expensive too, and I don't like spending coin at the moment. I'd rather upgrade my holdings. Now, this is going to be a very good one because it already has the copper mines. I don't know if it's already had the copper mines too, but. Oh, I could upgrade. Could I upgrade? Yeah! Yeah, this actually has the technology to make it into a silver mine. That's really good. I, I can eat all the money I can get. I need all them coins. Is there a trade route nearby? There is one up here, but I can't really get to that. Uh, there's also one down here, but also not really. I guess if I were to take over North Vancor, uh, Northern Vancor, then obviously I could get it, but I need to take over the capital here. Why does he not have a... I suppose this is not somewhere you can build one. Rafi, a slayer, has arrived in Kadran's well. Whether he's just passing through or searching for beasts to slay is unknown. Better keep an eye on him. Make him go, why? His kind is not welcome here. No, he's a slayer. Why would he not be welcome? I mean, very well. You can, you can be a commander. I could ask you to leave my court. But why would I do that? He's also a little bit insane. Maybe that's why I should send him away. Isn't he the former lord of this title right here? I could have sworn there was a slayer that, uh, a courier that went insane right over here. But, okay, so we are, we can't siege this territory down here. The garrison is too great right now. So we're just going to kill his army again and get the remaining wall scope from that. Uh, I don't like how close this was, but we did win and, you know, we can kind of force our demands and there we go. Yet another land. It has the title under our control. There is, of course, the problem that we have too much hold or too many holdings now. So I need to usurp this duchy over here or this duchy. But I don't think he's going to give me this duchy. 
Oh, he, no, no, he definitely has the dead sheet. I cannot absorb it because of the, um, yeah. I need a strong claim on it. Uh, so, he's probably not going to be too happy if I would just absorb it. Can't start a faction because, of course, I'm... Oh, Rafi is Slayer residing in New Province of Control has been... He's last been seen packing his weapons and wandering off. Farewell, Slayer. Goodbye. So how is my troops doing? Three s Why can I have so many troops all of a sudden? What? Wait, what? I don't get it. Where from? What? Okay, 1,600 from here. And we have uh, 800 from here. It's like, okay, no, it makes sense. It makes absolutely sense. Never mind. Should also, why could you raise so many? Like this guy can raise so many troops from these two castles. I, I see. I don't have any castles myself anywhere, but I should get more money. Hey, I won from this. Oh, hello. Yeah. What day is today? It's, it's th Thursday, isn't it? Right. Nice, thank you for the recruitment. I would like it over here, but I don't want to send him over because then he's going to lose. I lose to 600 troops over here, so. Yeah. 2,500 men. He has. Yeah, I only have 500 more than him right now, and I don't think that's good enough. Let's just wait. Let's just be patient and wait. Maybe even upgrade the silver mine along the way. I'm very confused that I don't make much more money. That's just... Probably I do pay more taxes. Also, I have this inefficient demands holding now. Could I do something against it? Probably not, really. Improve my stewardship, but... Let's actually take. Ah, no, I'm gonna lose so much, so many troops that I definitely need right now. Can't go away from Marshall. I was thinking about going uh, administrative because you know I could become ambitious and maybe learn masonry. Let's see, what do we get? Oh wait, wait, is that all we got? I mean, unless I need a little protection, that's fine. Um, I'll take it. It's more than my enemies have. Anyone has here because dwarves apparently are very bad at making magical items, even though that doesn't make any sense. Like, runesmithing should be pretty wild. Um, how are we losing this war, by the way? Oh, it's a zealot uprising that has conquered all of these lands. And you're winning against the zealot uprising? I don't understand that one. We need to take over Volkra, uh... Krakar Drak so that we can take over this territory and then we can take over this and then we have a lot of territory um sure I don't know who you are I, I guess I'm going to owe you a favor even though I'm going to declare warn you very soon and I got some more technology nice though I would rather have uh uh, like cultural advances, rather economic or military, but no, right? It's fine. Okay, now we have a lot of gold. Tax income, technology spread, or just straight up 60 more gunners. 60 more gunners sounds pretty dope. Also, takes two years, not two years, yeah, about two years to finish this thing. Wow, the next time barracks just takes like 10 years, I guess. Not quite, but like five years or something. No, not even five years. Like four years. Still, that's a time. <laughs> but it does give me not that many more either, so who knows. 2,700? Yeah, that's enough. Let's wait a war. 
And we're gonna quickly assemble our troops and then attack this fool of a man, dwarf. So, getting that guy and then this guy, and then we're gonna get you over here. So, we are. We would cross a river, so I'm going to attack over here. We also cross a river from here. I don't wanna cross a river. Can I not cross a river? There is just a river in my province, but why am I crossing it if I march from here to here? We would fight right over here or something. Well, I'm going to attack him in the mountains, which is also not the best idea, but I am a mountain expert, so maybe that's just going to save me here. But as long as we win on the flanks, um, we should be good to go, and we are definitely winning on the flanks, and also winning in the middle, We're winning everywhere. Oh, uh, yeah. Definitely. Let's get started. Oh, really? I thought the war would may, uh, might end the carousing. I uh, definitely have strong enough garrisons so that he won't be a problem. So now I can just resign my commanders and, you know, go back to sieging. Go back to sieging. Because he can't do stuff. It's not even close. Like, uh, the numbers in this time, so can just wait and do nothing. And then we have most of Krakow Drug. The problem is my friend over here. My friend is quite strong. So if I were to attack the, my leash, it's my friend that would, you know, cause most problems. But I could probably force him, like who? No, the king owes me a favor. That doesn't really help me. Could probably try making a claim on his uh, duchy. That might be good. Oh, I don't like that. Why do we have like you hired some mercenaries? Can you afford those? Not for long. Not for right now. But he's stuck down here. So as long as he doesn't combine them, I'm fine. Otherwise, I have to march to attack one of them. Probably have to do that anyways because I can't uh, siege down these. Um, yeah can't siege down these castles, so I do have to destroy his army at some point. Uh, I oh, I hope you don't hear my, my fan too much. I hope it doesn't blow into the microphone. Um, I do need a new... Uh, GPU, new graphics card, but damn, those things are expensive. Uh, and I'm really bad at saving up money. I'm really bad at. That's my keychain. Oh, no, no worries. I'm just trying to <laughs> busy myself with other things. What do you want? Um, please support me by voting with me in the council of every. Uh, who are you? Sure. Because I can't force you into my faction. You have troops. So that's good. Hey, more technology. Thank you. Okay, I don't like this. You are like a an imperial company or something. Oh, we are slowly winning the war against uh, the Robsman. Somehow. Alright, the siege is nearly over. Oh, it's so bothersome to siege anything dwarven made because they have just like so much forward level. It's actually insane. Like, if we look at like. Take a normal human castle, okay? Just like a normal human castle has like half the forward limit. And if you look at someone, some really tough castle, like this. Nothing! Like, Altdorf, where are you? They're not, even, they're not even coming close to dwarven fortresses. It's insane. And this is just a normal fortress. If you go to like the Ever Peak, you don't want to siege the Ever Peak, my dude. You do not want to siege the freaking Ever Peak ever. <laughs> it's just. It's not fun. <laughs> Takes so long. 
Oh no, my son is wounded. My heir. But we won. And now we have to crush his troops. Give me some commanders here. And we're gonna go crush his troops. Hopefully before he unites with them. Okay, he does actually intend to unite with them. But he just is getting reinforcements, which I don't like. Let's quickly take out his mercenaries. Oh man, that's... Why does he have so many troops all of a sudden? I guess the mercenaries. Oh, this is not good. Um, we did, do have enough reinforcements that if we lose this battle, I can just recall my troops. But uh, we're not gonna lose. Him. We're not gonna lose. We're not gonna lose. Him. And there we go. There we go. Another title. And now I don't need that many troops anymore. So I'm going to go to... Uh, rulership. And hopefully that gives me another domain limit <laughs> right away. It does not appear so. It's kind of bad. I do have a lot of gold. Uh, could I please get a domain limit? Uh, the Dwarven Alliance is really bad. Like, really bad. I guess I already have a lot of... Huh. could offer a donation to my leash, but I, I can't actually. Leash does not owe me a favor. Oh, oh, I see. He already owes me a favor, so I can't do it again. How many troops do I have at the moment? Yeah, I can have like 3,000. Of course, I lost a lot of troops from not being as great of a marshal anymore, but... I wish... I actually thought a bit more at the men's limit. But it might be 15 that I get the next point. Or something, I don't know. But I feel like this is a, a very good point to end the episode. I thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, then consider leaving a like and a comment down below. And we will see us in the next episode. And until then, take care. Bye.